Hello, you wonderful people, and welcome back to Undertale Yellow! Um, last time, uh, we got, uh, chased by a giant, or not a giant robot, but just a robot that was needing attention, but also not. Uh, it's a whole thing. Uh, oh, this is where we came from. Um, yeah, and so Robo's just been with us. We've been traversing through the Steamworks in particular, because that's supposedly where... We're gonna go through to get to Hotland, or are we passing through Hotland? One of the two. Either way, let us begin. What do we have here? Oh, oh, the UGPS! Watch it, Clover. We don't want to alert any outsiders, especially workers under Asgore like the UGPS. We may will have to wait. No, not my mail! Dang it. Howdy! Boy, am I glad that fox lady let you roam free for a bit. Not being able to talk to my pal has been torture. I know she roped you into some lab detour, but... Come on, Captain Monsters. Talk about a conspiracy nut. I mean, it's like you don't want to follow my advice. Remember your real mission, Clover. The five children you set out to find in the first place. There's no need to visit that dinghy lab, you know? Asgore's still out there threatening human lives. Keep your head in the game. This is our journey, not Saroba's. Actually, Fly, this is technically my journey, so... You just decided to involve yourself in it. Hey, wait up! I think I'm ready to get back into things. Lead the way. Why, of course. Oh, who we got? Goosick. Let's come to share some sounds. Goosick. Music drives the mood. I'm giving away one free ticket to the after. Whoa, what? Oh, that's. It's in one year and another one. Oh, that's so cool! Oh, I, I should have paid more attention. Okay. That was so cool, though. Um. Vibe. You try to enjoy the music, but can't keep up. Keep up, keep up! Okay, been spinning in circles. Move Goose's Needle to a new calmer record. Hey, what is this? Okay. No, that's actually one of the coolest battle mechanics I've seen, honestly. Also, because I'm a music nut, your drums do not appreciate the current situation. Let's see. Be calming down. Shouldn't change the song now. Oh, okay. This isn't a nice. Oh, uh oh. What's this? Oh, okay. Okay, so I should allow myself to get away easier. With that. Okay. Wait, what was it saying? Sound is unbearable. Okay. Let's see. Vibe? Close your eyes and tap your foot to the music. Music joins you. This is nice. Oh, shit. Okay. It's lost in the music. Boom, we're good. Cool. More steam. Fantastic. One more time, Clover. You got this. I know I do. Might have to use an item. How much is the honeydew coffee? <laughs> How much was this worth? Okay, what about the fries? 14. Not 5. Okay, I might as well have it then. At least I've gotten used to the taxes enough. Ooh. Okay, okay. Oh, okay. I overstepped that one. Oof. 
Got him. Let's go, Soroba. Imagine I've been saying her name wrong this entire time. I mean, that's fine. Oh, shit. I didn't look around. Well, that's fine. Holy. What happened here? Hope this stuff is okay to touch. I would hope so, too. Is this ice? A dried up fountain lies before you. Doesn't look remotely operational anymore. Oh, it's all the plants! Turn to the box and find a box bucket of nails. Sure. Got nails? Small pointed pieces of steel. Could be quite effective if fired at a high velocity. Oh my gosh, so it's like a nail gun. Nails into your gun. Okay, then I'll swap that with a rubber ammo. Various types of plants set within several containers. The smell is natural. Where are we building up to with this? Because, you know, plants first thought flowey, but this feels different. Like, the color feels very specific to science division. Police have reported the generator is showing more wear than ever. The engineers predict the machine won't last longer than one year from now. Okay. Interesting. You need to speed up the testing of alternative power sources. The underground depends on it. Head office. Okay. TV. Grown over robot. You can almost make out a face on its screen thing. To head office. More tests are underway, both biological and mechanical. We don't know which direction will ultimately be best for monster kind yet. However, the chemistry lab did have a breakthrough regarding a white plant. I'll get back to you on that once further testing is commenced. Science division. What is it? What is it? To head office. I think we've got it. The white plants have proven- why the music stop? Able to generate electricity at a fantastic rate. Oh no, it restarted. The only issues are that they grow four times faster than normal flora. Once their power is drained, they will they will into a dark, sticky substance. This is greenlit, we will need a new division to tend to these plants. Otherwise working conditions will suffer greatly. Science division. Two science division. The plant should suffice as a temporary solution. I've heard one of our top scientists is working towards a new compound. One made from special energy. It could be the key we need. Much more time is necessary to develop it properly, however. As for the proposed greenhouse division, I have an idea. Cheaper, more efficient, and trustworthy. I'll send you some blueprints shortly. Thank you for your time and research. Head office. Hmm. Side hand? Roll the blueprints lie in the box. You take a look. Gardener! Oh, I love that. That might be what we have to fight here, though. Here inside the box, nothing of interest here. Huh. Here inside the box, nothing of interest, okay. Oh, I don't... I probably wasn't meant to do that. Um, can I, can I reset it? Can I go back and, uh not have that happen. Can I take it back? Please tell me I can take it back. Okay, I think, yeah, it's good. We're good, we're good. Don't step on it, Soroba. Please do not. Okay. See, we're fine, we're fine. Um, uh-oh. What was that? I wasn't supposed to do that. Ah. Oh. Am. Awake. Gardener Model O2 status damaged. Oh, hello there. Was it you who disturbed the flora? I ask you to please have more respect. Um, we apologize. Won't happen again. Do not worry. Seeing that the child is so young, it is forgivable. I will report the incident as a level 303 for the... Level 10 offense. Level 10 means the termination of the trampler. Uh, hold on. Farewell. Oh. Ah! I'm stuck, Clover. We need to find a way out of this, fast. 
Okay. Oh, shoot. Okay. I've incapacitated your options. I ask you cooperate with me. This reminds me of that fan-made fight that someone made against Asgore where you have to get the pieces of the buttons before you can actually do anything. Uh. Green hostility is blossoming. Okay. There's more. Accept your offense, Trampler. Okay. Gardener slams her arms into the floor with agitation. Okay, cool. We got that. You must learn that plant life is important, more important than you. Oh. <laughs> See, that gave me no time! And I would just happen to be on the wrong end of it. Okay. Okay. No, I didn't mean to do fight! Oh, well that just goes fast in general. That's not fun. You're not yield, I will call for backup. Okay. Okay. All I can do is check, so I'm just gonna I'm gonna get item back out. Going to Okay. Let me work on item then. Cause this is I think another This is like a big fight, so it might be just like waiting. <sighs> they give you like no time. <sighs> oh, let's do the coffee. You can feel your taste buds burning off. 14, let's go. Okay, at least I found a good spot for this. Let's just try and get everything chipped off. I'm going to count three. Uh, what? Um, oh, excuse you. Her arms into the floor with agitation. One. Oh, um, well. <laughs> okay, at least that I have an easier time dodging because it's not just going to immediately fall on me. Water's your cage. Two. Not bluffing. See, the issue also is I don't know where half these attacks are coming from half the time. Okay, all I can do is this now. Three, calling back up. Oh no, they're friends. You call for help, Gardener? Correct. This trampler does not value the greenhouse. What is the offense level, miss? Ten, termination. Level ten? I mean, of course. We are sorry, offender. Gardener says you deserve termination. They know. I just said that. So, attack, right. It's only getting worse. Don't stop your efforts to free us. Oh. Ah. Oh, okay. I see. I see how this attack works as I immediately perish. Uh, I'm not going to tell you when it's going to slow down. I, I was fucked. I was fucked. Okay. There we go. Survived one. Keep it up. Okay, where are you guys doing this time? What the? What? what where are you getting that? I survived one attack. That's all I get. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, look at that. No hit. No hit on that attack. Let's go. Okay. All I can do is check. Let's get Mercy freed up first. Keep it up. Oh! Oh, I'm. Look at me go. Water's your cage. Please stay in your confines. Okay, let's get fight cleared up. Because I am going to check, but I want to see if getting fully freed will win me the fight. Okay. Oh yeah, that that should that should. Oh. Come on. Yes. Boom, got it. Way to go. I'll do what I can to help us escape for good. Oh, what do you mean? Beverly died. You have gained my respect, but you have not gained my mercy. Bots attack. Okay, good. I can def get defense. What? Oh. Oh, I can get trick it. Oh, no, I can't. What? Adequate job. Thank you for your help. No problem, gardener. Yeah, give us a call anytime. Even just to hang out or something. Or not, it's, it's not a big deal. Ugh, this is stressful. Okay, at least I don't have to deal with all the guys right now. Okay. So you and I again, it's too bad I cannot grow tired. For you, that is. Oh, shit. Okay, staying at the bottom seems like the best play for this, just because it allows me to see where everything is. Okay. Let's check. Should take her rage down a few notches, so it's really rage. I'm here for the attack. Oh, you missed it. <laughs> Seriously, man. Hey, it is okay. You're a flyer. Aw, cheer you up. Yo, thanks. Mind if I attack a little? By all means. Oh, oh, oh. What? 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 Ah! It has gone. Why does it have gone? I mean, it's pretty easy to dodge, but it's easy to get quartered too. Okay, let's use our last healing item, I guess. Still standing. You are rather upsetting. Yeah, I know. Oh, they're coming. Oh, oh, it's so bad. It's so bad. Okay. Okay. Gather. Pick some flowers and offer them. Gardeners to just... Okay, never mind. We'll get a long lecture. True torture. Oh, oh, not this attack. Well, I was out of healing items anyway, so... Oh, boy. Yeah, I know that, Flowey! Okay. Oh. Oh, this game. This game. Oh, shit. I forgot. The See, this guy just comes out of nowhere. And then I'm just like, ah! He gets so many, too. Okay. Let's plead again. Still standing, you were rather upsetting. Okay, they're gonna throw shit again. Oh, and this stuff explodes. Okay. Cool. Well, I'm glad I stay on the bottom. I might want to heal it one more time. Okay. Cool. I remember that attack. Also, I'm trying- I'm just trying to survive, guys, so sorry if I'm, like, skipping the dialogue. That this is misunderstanding. Events lethal lowered. That the head office will give you an award. Excellent, said ruining Gardener's Day. Deserved. I- I don't really know if it is, but okay. Maybe here. Yeah, there we go. Give in already. Oh, shit. I am just great at, like, getting hit by every single attack. Use rationale in hopes of de-escalating the situation. Offense level lowered. Wait. 
You, you. Offense level lowered. Oh. What happened? There seems to be a gap in my memory core. I am sorry. Okay, we did it. I think that did the trick. You're pretty clever in intense situations. I'm impressed. Oh, here we go. 50 gold! Let's go! Okay, that was slightly worth it. Everything. I was about to do something. Oh, yes, I remember. Sending level 3 report. Response negative. I apologize. Allow me to call again. Sending level 3 report. Hello, creator. Are you there? I believe my creator may be playing a practical joke on me. Signaling Steamworks head office. If the line you were trying to contact has been disconnected. Where... Where is everybody? That is weird. Oh. I have allowed immense overgrowth. I understand. It seems my day has passed. Cancel report and reinitiate re hibernation. Hibernation sequence engaged. I am sorry for inconveniencing you. I do not know what the world is like now, nor do I wish to. Hmm. Oh, <laughs> That's kind of sad, like his whole point. Life was m much better, not knowing. That's sad, the guy just wanted to like, live his life. <sighs> Let's keep moving. Aww. Oh, save point. <gasps> oh, finally. I, <laughs> you know, we're almost at the point that I would end the episode, like, like, time-wise, I can see, like, the timer on OBS, but literally, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna edit out so much of that fight that we're- it's not gonna be as much. Um, okay, so there's a lever there. What's over here? Let's hit the lever first. Okay, where do I go then? I'm just gonna assume that going west means something else. Oh. Televi- Televiz tunes in. Televiz. Can't live with or without one another. Network TV just ended all. Oh, is it like the screen and then like the VHS on the bottom? TV? Yeah, I do the work and they net the props to just end it all. Ooh. Okay, see this is predictable. Fills your head. Okay. Watch. Well, this is your favorite channel. Televiz, don't look abused. Nothing on yet. Because your antennas are crooked. Signals, uh, tapes went again. Oh. Uh, gotta adjust those. Help Telly finagle her antennas to find some programming. You attach me while you're at it just so I need it. Okay. Oh. Sing an anime open. Wait. <laughs> Viz begs her to stop. Watch. Until he finds a show she thinks she'll love. Whoa. Oh! That is so cool! Well, check this out. I'll admit this one is good. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Oh, that's so funny. Holy cow. I love that. I so you enjoyed the program. Oh, I did. Thank you. 25 gold, not bad. So what's this way then? Oh shit, this is where we were meant to go. Oops. Two paths. Hold on. That symbol, I've seen it on Chujin's work uniform. Let me try one of his codes. Nope. Ugh. Well, I only have one left, but I've already used it. Here goes. Seriously? Same code as the Dunes Gate? With this kind of security, no wonder Axis is so vigilant. After you. Okay, perfect. Please, no. Please let me go back. Thank you. Oh. I'm sorry, Soroba, for the inconsistency, but I literally have no fucking idea where to go half the time, so... Okay, what's through here? Is it Mo again? Or does this just lead us back? Yeah, this just leads us back, doesn't it? That's cool. Okay. Good to note. Cool. Is 
You know, the sad thing is, I wish I had played this game so close in proximity to... I want to flee now. Um, so close in proximity. Um, clean. I seem offended. Oh, there's multiple things. Oh, and I forgot Slippery. Oh, bring me the soap! Okay. Oh, no. Stupid Jandroid dumb. Ugh. No, it's actually the worst because I hate the slippery floor. Anyways, like I was saying, like, I really wish I had played this game more closer in proximity to, like... Okay, cool, I didn't get attacked that time. Okay, this just doesn't open then. Um, more closer in proximity from when I first started playing it. Because, like, oh, this is so... I love this. Like, the story that they're trying to tell is really special. Oh, hey. Hello? Rusted through. Hassan says, if the receptionist is unreceptive, check with the robot control station three floors up. Robot control station. Clover, are you thinking what I'm thinking? Axis? Exactly. If there's some sort of breaker box for all robots in the area, you can shut Axis down to get to Hotland as planned. It's worth an investigation at least. Let's go. Ooh. That is worth it. I'm very thankful for all the save points. You know what? Okay, you know what's weird? Why is Flowey intentionally trying to hide from all of, like, our people? Like, that feels a bit strange. And also, like, because I remember... The lore of Flowey is that Flowey was made in the true lab. And Soroba has ties to the lab. Maybe... I'm pretty sure the true lab is what it's implied. Because, you know, we're... Um, it's like the whole story of like falling down and everything. An empty elevator shaft lies before you. Well, Dan, convenience was never in today's dictionary anyway. Gotta be a staircase close back. Okay. But yeah, I just, I have to wonder if there's a connection there like the. Ooh. This reminds me of Inscription, like the, um, the second act, but the, both the second and third acts when, the second act when you're in PO3's domain. Good morning, Steamworks employees! Hope you're ready for another day of product productivity. Today we are boxing and shipping goods out into the underground. Uh, hello? Are you sentient or pre-recording? Hello, new hire! Yes, I'm fully sentient! Trapped in this two-dimensional rectangle for all eternity! Ah, 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 ah! Right. Can you unlock all the doors in this factory? We're in a hurry. Sorry, but each morning we do a little thing called Earn Your Freedom! Complete a full shipment and you'll be on your way- Oh no. What kind of policy is that? When there's a quota to meet ethics, go out the window! Oh, this is just Amazon. Uh-oh. Haven't you worked a job before? Of course, but I don't work here. So you're trespassing? In that case, fine. Fine, we'll do the job. Clover, this bot might have connections to Axis. Seems we gotta do what it says to avoid unwanted attention. We can work this thing, right? Push the start button, we'll get it over with. Oh, goodness, we have to be at Amazon delivery. Okay. What are you doing? Put red items in red boxes and blue items in blue boxes. Three strikes and you're out. Your machine's broken. The second conveyor belt doesn't move. No. It, yes. It's bro- No! S screw this. Clover, you box the goods and I'll toss them into the chute. <laughs> Teamwork, right? Something like that. Let's give it a shot. Okay, what the- Where do I- Oh, ZX, okay. Boom. Boxed. 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 What? How was that a strike? Oh, you- Oh. Oh, it's just trash.
Oh. What? Was that a good thing? I got it. I thought I failed. I saw the 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 the, the, the three check marks. I was like, oh. "Hey, all right. Good work, Clover. On to whatever awaits us next." Let's leave. I don't want to put up with this Palma Minecraft story mode bullshit. Uh, oh, not another one. What the? Fun! Hello again! The shipment is almost complete. I really hope I'm not peeking the mic when I'm yelling this. One final step and you may have the passcode to exit. All you have to do is sort each colored package by tilting the platform left or right. Pretty obvious. Thank you, paid attention, learning colors in preschool! Not by choice. I'll take the drop shoot on top. You man the platform. Good, good. Okay, uh, ooh. Ready? Here goes nothing. Uh oh. Okay. Okay. Go that way. 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 Okay, go that way. Perfect. We did it perfectly. We're so great. Yeah. Coming back down. Great job, everyone! You can't spell Steamworks without teamwork. Can't spell it without steak either, but that has absolutely no bearing on this situation. Let's see how you did. I mean, you don't know. Maybe the engineers want to cook a good steak. Calculating. Ah, oh, you barely scraped by, but that's what performance reports are for. What? What? I did that one per- Okay, unless you're talking about the first one, but I only got like one strike on the first one. Hey, it isn't our fault this system is so impractical. Why does it take two giant steps to ship a few packages? Why can't we sort the colors when boxing them in the first room? Yeah. Beats me. You know, for being built by such great minds, the steamworks are awfully convoluted. It takes a massive IQ to understand the complexities of the steamworks. Your brain probably isn't advanced enough, says the wall man a GIF comprised of three pixels. You know what? You can take your little passcode and... Uh, just give us the code. Aww. They make a good team. Of course. The passcode is 7998. Got it? 7998. Yeah, thanks. No, thank you, employees. Thank you for making the underground a little brighter. Yeah. This is... I, I like Clover's personality in this, because they're just kind of... Okay. There we go. Yeah. Because they're... They're, they're really quiet, much like Frisk, um, but they add a bit of charm to this. Because it's like, they're not, they don't have no presence in the story. They have actually quite a bit, especially with the characterization of Starlo kind of adding things to this. Bellworks emergency escape plan, or meep. Meep! Meep! In case, someone, in case someone sets the room on fire, do not use the elevator. Evacuate down to floor 01. Use a passcode to access floor 03. Uh-huh. They really locked this place up tight. Well, if the code was found nearby on the first floor, let's take a look around. Okay. Whoa. Ugh! There you are. No way. You seriously want to do this again? Yes. Remember the explosion that incapacitated you? Yes. I retreat brand new hands. I am unstoppable now. Look, at some point you need- Shush. Do not resist arrest any longer. Stand still and let my handsome hands shine. Oh. Shoot. Psst, Clover, this way. My vision. Initiating six volt super flashlight. Whoosh. 95% of power utilized. Topography box hindered. What do you mean? Oh. This is most un- This is bad. Oh well. Unlike them, I have eyes. 
Wheel. Okay. We need to stay out of his view and keep quiet. We just gotta... Hello again! Whatever are you two... <laughs> As I was saying, there's gotta be a code around here. Once you find it, head for the exit. See, I like Sora, but she's like a more laid-back Susie. Rusty machine once used for shaping gold ore into coins. Doesn't seem functional. Oh. Oh, that's a strategy. Empty elevator shaft lies before you. You figured out a code? Hurry up and give it a try. Imagine it's just the... Try something- oh, oh! Oh, oh, I thought he was just gonna go down this hall. That would've been intense. Okay, wait. A large collection of familiar stones. Fortunately, nothing in the pile catches your eye. Well, shit. A3. C4. A3. C4. B3. Okay, so that was... A, so three, three, four, oh, three, three, four, three. Boom. Alphabetical order, baby. Okay, let's head upstairs for Axis. Hello. Axis? Just the bout I was looking for. How are you? How are you doing these days? Not so good. I could only speak at 15 characters max back there. How? This is... Okay, this isn't so loud. People can still hear me. It kind of bummed me out. I'm sorry to hear that. Glad you got your full speech ability back. Thank you. I do like talking. Wait. Wait. Are you trying to distract me from my mission? No. Oh, okay. Can I ask you a question involving the security of the Steamworks? Yes, I am a security expert. Why is it that some doors require a passcode to unlock, and others require a Steamworks ID? Two-factor authentication. Huh. <laughs> cool. <laughs> okay. Workstations. Okay, well, probably another code to find. You know the drill. Let's see what we got around here. They're all struck by the absolute pipe pandemonium on display. How do they do it? She neatly typed bullet points lies crumpled in the trash. You stash it in your mailbag. What do I got in here? Bullet points? Read. Helper bot guidelines. Every manufactured bot must have a practical function installed. A purpose for being, cooking, cleaning, agriculture, etc. Bots should have tiers of emotion to better ingrate into society. Coding a personality into each one is recommended. It makes them more reasonable, easy to be around. All bots are to have a strong connection with living things. Their creators, average monsters, their bots. Deprived of this, some may become easily agitated and restless. Others may be unfazed. Depends on the model. If a bot acts out of line or malfunctions, they are to be shut down. Typically, a hard reset will do the trick. Termination is a last resort. If a shutdown is impossible, they can be coaxed back into their normal state. Absolutely no bots are allowed outside the Steamworks at this time. Until King Asgore is ready to begin mass production, this project is classified. Most of all, have fun. Interesting. So, Asgore hasn't approved it, most likely because this place, I think, just got overrun. One by, like, the white flowers and everything, the plants, the fauna. And I think a lot of the people just went missing or something like that? Maybe when Alphys got appointed as the royal... Well, I don't know. Because, yeah, Alphys was appointed as the royal scientist. So I wonder if the absence of Gaster really messed up things. Especially since, like, Gaster is such, like, this mystery in, like, the Undertale universe. And it's just, like... You know, with him being missing and, like, him, like, being, like, deleted from people's memories just means that, like, 
it could be that people are just left in such a state of disarray because maybe he was really leading the charge on so many of these projects. It's on the screen gives you a nostalgic feeling. Or maybe once Gaster left, everything was appointed to Asgore, but Asgore didn't know how to literally do anything. <laughs> like, no shade, I love Asgore, but like, he's not a scientist. Make sticky notes or posts around the Smashing PC. Just place your note six times now. Well, his temper, it's just solitaire. <laughs> Right, it's Solitaire. But yeah, it got appointed to Asgore, and Asgore didn't know how to do everything. That's kind of what we're experiencing right now. Or, no, no, no. Then it got appointed to Alphys. And, but by that point, because now we're at a point where it, Alphys is in charge, because there was a quiz where it was like, uh, who is the current royal scientist? It was Alphys. So maybe stuff got appointed to Asgore, and then it got appointed to Alphys, and that's where we're now. And now everything's shut down because it took too long, and everything is just in an overrun state. On the password, so the future is bright. Hang in there. Wait. Okay. Okay. What was- there was a number on this. We have a computer six times now. On two desktops. The image on the screen gives you a nostalgic feeling. That's so familiar, what is that? Oh wait, notes. Downsizing imminent. Definitely not for the employee who's reading this. You're doing a great job. Must be the manager's office. Surely they had access to all passcodes. Let's check those file cabinets. Hold on, look here. Performance reports for all factory employees. A, B, Cajun, or Kaj, what the fuck? Six, January 16th, 20-something. Mr. Chujin, Chujin, not Cajun. Chujin pitched, pitched his blueprints for a guard bot of sorts. He called the project Axis. March 19th, 20-something. Axis Model 01 was presented to King Asgore, but was swiftly rejected. Poor thing couldn't stay powered up for more than six seconds. May 10th, 20-something. Axis model 04 backfired and shot one of its gloves at the king. This is getting embarrassing. <laughs> My brain had to do the mental math. July 23rd, 20 something. Axis model 07 refused to enter the throne room. Escort gave Chujin one more shot after incessant pleading. I know he's a smart engineer, but if the next showcase goes south. September. September 23rd, 20 something. Well, this is it. Model 08 booted up and seemed to be stable for a moment. That was until a malfunction occurred and sparks began to emit from the body. In the chaos, one spark leaped onto King Asgore's flower bed. Fire ignited, but was swiftly put out. Please leave. Leave and do not return. I, I apologize deeply. But as we are, us monsters simply aren't ready to bypass the barrier. You know this deep down, I know you do. Axis is is the solution you need. The solution I need is a reliable one. One that won't set fire to our homes. If this is about my- It isn't. I thank you for your service to society. But I'm afraid Monster Kind's freedom belongs in more capable hands. Mm. Capable hands, he says. Look at Axis now, the true realization of Chujin's vision. He far exceeds any model Asgore ever saw. And you know who those capable hands now belong to? The scientist who is Conoco, Dr. Alphys. A while back, she built a robot too. Once so lifelike, it got her to the position she has now. It must have been real impressive. So impressive that Asgore kicked the other visionaries to the curb. Oh, so, okay, so maybe my Asgore theory was a bust, but still, that's interesting, because she was appointed, and that must have meant that all of these projects got, so, yeah, that's literally what it's saying, all of these projects got shut down. So, yeah, and that's interesting, because the thing about Metaton is he isn't, like, sure, he has a robot body and everything, and that itself is pretty, like, spectacular, 
like that Alphys was able to build that. But he's not like made by like, he, he isn't an AI. He's just a ghost that's inhabiting something like that. And that's something that's interesting because Alphys is a royal scientist. Like it's clear with all the experiments and the guilt she feels over the amalgamates and everything like that. But I've also seen like different interpretations of it where it's just like she is in over her head. Alphys is like that like, um, like that college student that gets like or not even college student but like that one employee that just gets promoted way too quickly alfie's is like the michael scott of the undertale universe that's my that's my piece for today but like literally because like the whole thing with like the office and i'm sorry rant time is that like michael was an amazing employee like an amazing salesman before he got promoted to being a boss which he just felt out of his comfort zone and that's i feel like might be the case for alfie's because like her experiments like granted like there was so much unknown with them but it's interesting because like she tries that and she like she guns for that her research on that and what do you have the amalgamates are born from that and then i mean she experimented on flowey and flowey escape but that really wasn't her fault flowey just kind of dipped <laughs> so but that's interesting because it does kind of give like that kind of character who just like is in a position that they were forced into really too quickly and i think that's interesting I understand now why Chujin never shared this with me. You must have been absolutely gutted hearing those words. Screw the royals. The politics, all the red tape. This clover, this is why the mission is so important. You can't trust these closed-minded gatekeepers to do anything right. Not for a second. Let's go. Do we have a... So I'll very pass go. Oh, 2595. That's really easy, actually. But we'll have to get to it in the next episode. <gasps> yeah. Thank you guys so much for tuning into this one. Like, the lore on this is so fascinating. And I love, I love fandoms who, like, take something that already exists and just expand on it further than rather than trying to rewrite something. Like, it's not terrible if that happens, but I just love it. Like, the... And this isn't really a fandom example, but um, when that Phineas and Ferb special episode came out, <laughs> my juxtapositions this episode are so funny. But like the one with like the Star Wars universe, where it's like Phineas and Ferb get implemented into that on Tatooine, and like Doofenshmirtz is like a part of that. It just it creates like this extra like bonus narrative to it that just kind of fits right in. It and they don't even need to do too much because the groundwork has already been laid. So you have these like existing like things like we have flowey we have toriel we have asgore alfies like all these existing characters that we know and love and we're getting more added onto it which just kind of expands it even more it may not it's not even canon but it's like it really helps like expand kind of just the i don't even want to say lore because again to say it would be lore would to say that this would be canon which it's not unless toby fox is just like I think this is everything we need and everything like that, which would be amazing. But it's two different teams working on two different, like two different projects. Like Toby Fox didn't have a hand in this, so there could very well be something that contradicts with his lore. But either way, um, I still think it's awesome, awesome like ideas that just grow upon just the Undertale universe in general. And I'm very excited to see what it does next in the next episode. Bye bye. <laughs>